Oh, hey, it's Eric. Funny seeing you here. Stats, pets, literally nothing's changed since last time. But today we're going to a dark place. I fear no man, but that thing, it scares me. Must be nice. And to make it even fucking worse, to start this world, you have to talk to Cyrus. Who the fuck am I? Hey! Oh, hello, wizard. Did I just summon you? Cyrus sent you here? Is it myth-related? I sure hope not. I just really don't want to do this. I'm a bit sad. Actually, I'm lying. I'm quite devastated. So quick side note, I never bothered to make like an energy pet before. I just kind of thought they were always useless because like you would have to take them off anyways when you want a pet train. And like I didn't think they gave enough energy to like actually be helpful in gardening. But this pet and like I'm not even done making it yet is already giving me like 42 extra energy. This can give me well over 50 energy like this Corgi pet because like this Dapper Corgi it gives you plus eight as like just kind of its base thing. I just think that's kind of wild. So if you haven't, you know, definitely look into making one of these because it's 50 free energy every time. You enter the pyramid and rescue her? Like a true American, I'm about to go desecrate a sacred burial ground slash tome. Get up! What security guards? Teachers get guns! I want everybody with a fucking gun, cocksucker! <laughs> go search the pyramid. You'll have to get permission from the king's guard, Acosta Hanging. Us Americans don't ask for permission. That's what we have reparations for. Don't forget who the fuck we are, you understand me? We're the baddest motherfuckers out there. I know I, I know I shit on these quests, but every once in a while, you know, it's nice just to go around and pick some flowers. We are fully in the just two blade seven pip AoE over and over grind of Azteca. Holy shit. Fire beats ice. This was just ripped straight from Pokemon, I think. Take the badge of leadership from my cold, dead hands. Oh my god, we fucking killed him? What the fuck? What the fuck? I've totally forgot that even existed. That's such a weird piece of gear. Like, why give me balance crit block? That's just odd. <laughs> It's like those, uh, those balls. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock! The balls, no, what's that one thing where, like, you can make them, like, float around in your hand back in the day? Used to come on during Spongebob. You know what I'm talking about? Like, that one really energetic guy? You're about to be mesmerized. It's here. It's wild. It's sweeping the nation. It's... Mushigi! I fucking hate this game. There are actually like no myth things in this world. This is the first time I've had to put him prisoners. Brass monkey, that funky monkey. You know he's powerful because he gets this uh, all caps text to talk in. Seriously, do these people have any idea how long you've been studying as a wizard? Yet here you are once again in the muck. That's what I've been saying. You look the statue over, you notice a part is missing, the head. Probably important. A trail goes into that tomb. Ugh. It's self-aware! They know how stupid this fucking defeat and collect quest is gonna be. Easier to teach a piggle to fly. Wait, that doesn't work. No, oh, Ponce de Gabon. All right, we can finally activate this now. Definitely gonna want to grab Reliquary. I'm really looking forward to Sharpen Blade, though, and Potent Trap. That'll make those are actually very useful spells. But now it's just back to the defeat and collect grind. Look how slow that fucking thing is moving. Get in the fight. We're getting a little too comfortable with the amount of things I have to use, like defeat in these defeat and collect quests. Zlotl? Very close to Axolotl. I feel like I should be able to claim the Zlotl Tower. This is mine now. Finally restore the Sun Obelisk. And finally, get Potent Trap and Sharpen Blade. This is gonna help so much with questing. It must be nice. Sad frog. I always totally forget they crammed all these like underwater segments into these second arc worlds. Probably just to make sure that all these like floating textures and underwater sounds didn't just go to waste, but they're just so random. I would just like to point out how epic the, the energy corgis underwater animations are. Oh dear god. Alright, before I get the spell, I figured I'd give you guys a room tour just because, you know, I haven't really done a dorm room tour in a while. We got some plants in the back here, just trying to get to gardening level 3, just getting some, you know, once these get to elder, get a few harvests, I could get maybe a couch potato farm going on this account, I'm not really sure. I got the myth banner, got my bed, my crystal ball, you know, wizard stuff, that's where I sleep. Got some of my achievements up on the wall here, that's like a plague oni wand, I think, and just thought it'd be good for a stitch if I ever decide to do one. Got the bunny, of course got the sword of kings hanging on the wall because there's literally no other fucking use for it because it's terrible got some ancient artifacts on a wall the dog poster 
And of course, you know, I had to get with the floor space to get my covered wagon in here. I sincerely doubt I'll ever use this spell because it's fucking 10 pips, but it is the biggest number of damage I've gotten so far, so I'll throw it in. Why not? I can't believe I wasn't recording, but it just says it's no sort of king. This is the way, this is like the dawn actually you have to use to do something. It says it's no sort of kings, but you think it will serve. And y'all don't have a problem with this? You just gonna let this slide? I'm pretty sure you also get this weapon, so we'll see how shitty it is. I mean, like, guys, come on. I mean, honestly, that's not the worst thing ever if I didn't have a plus 10 damage wand that was accessible at level 30, but, you know. Okay, that's actually pretty sick. And this is where this world goes from really bad to terrible. Let me tell you why I absolutely hate that they brought back Malastare. This is one of the worst story decisions ever. The first arc story is beautiful. The first arc was just beautiful. It ended with Malastare coming to terms with reality and and accepting the fact that he can't change mortality he finally came to peace with that and azteca just goes nope he's angry and hates the wizard and he's burning a black cool <laughs> You know, I think Tri said it best when he said the only redeeming quality of this world is that it all gets destroyed at the end. So now that that's over, on to the rankings. I would just like to start this off by saying that I made one video for all of Azteca, for an entire playthrough of Azteca. I also had to rewatch that entire playthrough to edit this video, okay? A lot of people could have made 15 Let's Play videos out of that, but no, I sat down and made one video, so you better fucking subscribe. Now, this world just makes me angry. The gameplay's just bad at this point in the game. I mean, it's stale, it's so repetitive, there's no interesting bosses in this world whatsoever. They basically just said, hey, we'll give everyone more health so it takes longer. That's, that's, that's their new innovative gameplay. The story isn't just, like, boring, it's bad. Like, bringing back Malister was a bad decision. It destroys the first arc. This is stupid. And he's not even really given redemption in this world. He's kind of given redemption later, but no, no. This is just a complete waste of time. The music's all right. The theme's kind of cool, I guess. It's like an old ancient world, but really who gives a shit because it, they don't really ever do anything with it interesting. It's the worst world in the game, far and away. There is the literal only redeeming quality about this, like Tri said, is that it all gets destroyed in the end. That's it. It's terrible. Goodbye. At least it only gets easier from here, though. Wait, what's the next world? I hope you enjoyed because I certainly didn't. Make sure to join the Discord links in the description. Also, follow me on Twitch and Twitter. Links are all in the description down below. Um, outside of that, I hope you have just a good day and uh, on to uh, Chrysalis. God damn it.